Did you hear? <laughs> Chanel is having the third price increase for this year. The third. I was gonna say a word I don't want to say because YouTube algorithm will be against me, so I'm not gonna say it. But I know we're all thinking it. The f is that? <laughs> Hi guys, it's Naomi Arsenio and I'm just here to share in the outrage that I have seen on the internet, on Obama's internet, as Ms. EJ Speaks likes to say, but the lunacy, guys, the absolute friggin' lunacy, the Chanel Small Classic in caviar and lambskin, the flap, all the flaps have gone up again in price, and the Small Classic, which at the beginning of this year was, I believe, like $5,500, is now as of November 3rd, going to be $8,200. <laughs> oh, that number got stuck in my head, my throat. You know what I mean. Isn't that insane? <laughs> like, <laughs> laughing at me. But honestly, I mean, you know, I'm not even going to say it's a pandemic and, you know, people don't have money because seriously, if, if you're even looking at Chanel, then yeah, you know, you have money. So we're not even going to go there. But it's just the audacity, you know, it, it, it takes audaciousness to add 30% because let's let's add it up 10%, 10%, 10% per price uh, increase to add 30% to the price of a bag. That's lunacy. Let me tell you, the small classic. $8,200, medium, $8,800, jumbo, $9,500, a maxi is now $10,000. Well done, Chanel, you are now running with the big boys, aka Hermes. Ooh, I find that so crazy. So, yeah, I think in June, June-ish, the small classic was 62 and it is now, it jumped up to 7100 I feel like it wasn't even a month ago. Maybe six weeks ago? I don't know. And now, as of November 3rd, it will be 8200 So it's actually, this price increase was 15%, this last one. Um, yeah, the classic flap, oh, that's $1,100. I just did the math. That's it. <laughs> Chanel came to play, okay? Somebody at their brand said, oh, people are using stimmy checks. People are using stimulus money. People are using their uh, American federal dollars to buy these handbags. We're going to make the government work for us. Woo! Classic medium flap went up from 7800 to 88 12.8% increase. The classic jumbo flap went from 8,500 to 9,500, 11.8. And the classic maxi went from 9,200 to 10,000. That was an 8.7 raise. I mean, mm. I hear also that these increases are going to happen to the boy bags. They're going to happen to the 19s. I mean, yeah, right in time for Christmas. I bet you come November 3rd, every single store is going to be flooded with bags because. <clears throat> Yeah, why not? You made it probably a year ago for when it was selling $5,500. We all know the material of the bags is not cons con commensurate to the actual prices of the bags. But I mean, personally, I've been been priced out. So <laughs> I'm not hurting. I'm not in the market. I wasn't saving for one. I just buy my little pieces of jewelry. Um, so hey, it is what it is. Although I do find it interesting because I do get pictures from my SA at Chanel, at Saks, Chanel and Saks. And I do find it interesting that Chanel has come out with a lot of little itty bitty dinky bags that barely fit a cell phone. And those now are going at that $2,000 to $3,000 price range because for a lot of people, that is their comfort zone. Like, oh, $2,000, $3,000, I can live with that. Once you start hitting 6,000, 7,000, 8,000, most people like pause. Like, yeah, you could buy a car. You could buy a whole semester tuition at college. Uh, yeah, I spent your college fund on a Chanel bag, baby. She's pretending she didn't hear me, but she's right over there. But you know what I'm saying? It's like, okay, so you're gonna introduce this little, little tiny bags that we know 
probably cost you, I don't know, $300 to make and you're selling those for $3,000 and then your classics that we know probably may maybe cost you a little bit more to make and you know the price is inflating but you've got to still keep buyers at that entry level price point and I think what is amazing is of course that that entry level price point has gone up for for a lot of people like especially Louis Vuitton it used to be that the entry price point the 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 entry price point for a bag was a thousand for Chanel maybe two thousand so you know it's still for most people a thousand two thousand maybe three thousand is was where they're comfortable with spending Obama lost the left the rest of my footage more of a rant just saying that you know Chanel's making smaller purses at smaller price points so that the bigger purses can remain exclusive. Bye!